Someone's calling me. I just got a phone call about an ESS interview. I'm not a Visco girl. Hey. Reporting live from Planet Basic. We talk a lot. Hi guys, so today we're gonna be doing what's in my backpack for the first semester of senior year. So I have a Jaw Raven Konkin. I'm not a Visco girl. Outside of my backpack, I carry my binder because I usually need this stuff in it like quickly. <laughs> and also because I don't have that much space in my backpack because I carry a lot of things. This is my senior year binder cover. I'll put like a better picture of it right here. I'm very proud of it. Let's go inside. Can't show you guys it. We have like base tattoos for like my school for football games and stuff because I bought a bunch of those because I thought one tattoo meant one, it meant two, so I have a bunch of them. I have like a parking permit thing, key club stuff, Disney club stuff, theater stuff, senior stuff, all that sort of stuff is in here. School newspaper because I thought it was interesting that week. We got paper, and then, oh my god, wait, 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 I need to show these. So when I was doing back-to-school shopping at Target, I found these pastel binder dividers. I, like, barely use them, but they're so pretty. I'll probably use them more next semester, but I love them so much. Like, look at this. Look at this gradient. Oh. Bro, these are so pretty. I love them. If I don't use them this year, I will use them next year. I will use them at some point. They're so gorgeous. There's five of them, so I guess I kind of have five sections. There's nothing in the very first section, which is film studies. The second section has sociology stuff, but there's like one paper in it. The third section has expos stuff, so like articles. The next section, I have APEL stuff, but I dropped APEL. The very back section, I have like some Disney Club stuff. So then I have like my school schedules and stuff like that. Also outside of my backpack, I carry my Hydro Flask. I don't like drink that much water and my friend should keep a bottle for me for my birthday. So yeah, again, not a Visco girl. It's got a bunch of stickers on it. So Rachel gave me a bunch of like vine stickers and like this egg because I'm an egg. I decorated it. It's very strategic planning here. It's very dented because I drop it. And then we got an equality sticker that I got from Club Rush from the GSA club. And then we have one of my Wee Bear Bear stickers, but it's like one of my least favorite ones because I feel like I'm not going to use my Hydro Flask like my entire life and I want the best stickers to be with me for most of my life. I'm very proud of my stickers. And then also today I was carrying my vlog camera in my backpack because I was vlogging, so you guys should watch that vlog. Um, I don't know when it'll be up, but yeah. And then here's my phone. I usually carry this in my pocket. It's getting very messed up. Like the screen protector's peeling off. It's cracked, like the actual screen, but you know, it's okay. And then here's my backpack. It's very heavy. There are two side pockets that are not very good, so that's why I have to carry my Hydro Flask. And then there's this little pocket and the very big pocket. So in the side pockets, let's see what's in here. One of them is empty. <laughs> and then the other one has my scissors for easy access. And there should be, there's a scissors holder in here as well. I don't know if I actually stick the scissors like back into it every time I put them in. And that's it. Wow, that's weird. I usually have more things in there. Then up here is the very little pocket. We have my wallet. I got it for my 15th birthday. We have some icebreaker duos in the flavor strawberry. I've been eating a bunch of these the past couple days because I'm getting sick so my throat gets scratchy. So these are great to have on hand. Also because we had like bagels at home today and so I was like, gotta have my duos. Then we have earbuds. I actually don't really use these that much this year because I'm like barely at school. I'm there for like three periods. And then we have a pad that I put in there over summer, I think. We have some peach mango sanitizer from Bath and Body Works. We have a hair tie. We have a tampon that I also put in there over summer. And that's it. It's actually very clean today. That's wild. Now for the main pouch of the backpack, which is where literally like everything is. If you open it, it's a rectangle and it's got like a back pad so that way your back is like supported. It's pretty great. So I have my keys in here. They're on a Walt Disney World lanyard because I bought it at Disney World. I am very, very proud of these two things right here. So we have my little Iron Man Pop Funko keychain. I got it for one of my birthdays because like Hot Topic gave me like a free five bucks or something. And then this is my, um, how do you pronounce it? Mijon, it's Thor's hammer. I bought it from D23 Expo and I like to hold it and say I'm worthy. But usually when I'm wearing this, it hits my Hydro Flask like, oh, it's not doing it, hold on. There's no water in it, so. So it sounds like a bell when I walk. It's kind of heavy though, so it weighs down my neck, but that's okay. Then we have my pencil pouch. This is my I Has Cupquake pencil pouch. I believe I bought it at VidCon last year. It's super cute. It is pastel purple on the top and then pastel like mint green. Oh my god, it kind of matches my nails. Pastel down here with like video game things and cute things. Very, very adorable. Love it. So inside of it, I have lead. We have the thin Sharpie highlighters. We have my favorite kind of pencils. They are the Papermate 
it doesn't really matter what size lead, but the paper, these ones, these paper mate ones. We have the best type of eraser, these like white ones, although there's only half of it. Don't know what happened to the other half. And then we have my favorite kind of pens, which are, again, paper mate, and I don't know what they're called. But they're my favorite type of pens because they're so smooth. I go through the black ones really, really fast, so I actually need to replace this one. I just ran out of ink today while I was taking sociology notes. Oh, and then I have a Sharpie from VidCon that says Tour Supply Incorporated on the side. So yeah, I just have all the different colors of the pens and stuff because I like to have lots of colors. This year I don't like have a favorite pencil yet. Like I usually develop one because like it'll be the only one that has lead, but right now most of them have lead. So here's my other ones. We have the hybrid one. Don't know what happened to the other hybrid one because there should be one out there. And then we have these two, you know, the highlighters, the pens. That's all that's in my pencil pouch, and I will put a new black pen in there. Moving on, this is my Real Akuma, like, emergency bag. If I'm going anywhere, I can just take this out of whatever bag it was in and put it in whatever bag I'm bringing. That's why it's so great. We have ibuprofen that you're not supposed to have, but I have it. We have tampons, hair ties, pads. I used to have band-aids in here, but I think I use them all. I have paper towels because... One time I was gonna do the face tattoos at school, but then the game got rained out. There should be some bobby pins in here, yep. So it's literally like, you know, anything I could ever need. I have another really cute, like, bag that I want to make another, like, emergency kit in. Then moving on, we have another pencil case thing. This I bought from Bunny Fest when I volunteered last year. So it's very, very, oh, so it's very adorable. And in here I keep my mild liners. So that way it's, like, easier because I used to keep them in this pouch with my pens and stuff but then I would like lose whatever color I wanted to find. So now I just have my favorite colors in here. I leave like four of the colors at home. So like the brown and like the gray and the colors I don't want. I need those colors, but like I don't need them at school. So instead we have like the main rainbow colors instead. I love these, they're very pretty. And then we also have little post-it notes because I love little post-it notes and if I keep them in my regular pencil pouch, they're gonna get drawn on by my pencils, you know? So I, yeah, I have like three different bags in my backpack. Moving on, we have the Joy Luck Club book. I got it from my public library because we have silent study hall at our school, so some of the English teachers like make you read, other teachers just let you play on your phone. My teacher, she doesn't let you do like other classes homework and stuff during that time, which is kind of weird because like if you have the time to do your homework, you want to do your homework, right? So I have this in case I do want to read. I got it because my Honors American Literature class last year, some of the kids read it because it was like book circles, except I read East of Eden. But this was like my second choice, so I was like, let's read it this year. We have this beauty right here, my day designer. I got this because of Danielle Marie Carolin, and mine is black and white striped. They're a bit pricey for planners, but it's because it's got every day. Like, it's great. Let's see what's happening today. Film backpack video, I'm doing that. I got a lot going on with like school and college apps and stuff. So one side of this has your entire day, like the hours planned out. So if you have like, I had to do link crew at 6 a.m. today and stuff like that. And then I write down like my classes and then I can plan out what I'm gonna do like at every time of the day. And then on the other side, it's got a to-do list. So you can write down all the things you need to do. And at the top, it's got the today's top three. So like, you know, the things you need to get done. It's got a do, dinner, dollars, don't forget, and then it's got notes at the bottom, so if I like need a constant reminder, I'll write it down there. It's pretty great, and then it also has calendars, and the front has like a bunch of like life goal planning kind of, or like, you know, sort of seeing where you're at right now in life. Here is one of the calendars, this is September. I'm trying to like kind of color code it. I do a lot in like just black pen, but the main colors I kind of stick to, I do dark blue for YouTube, red for college things. I'm trying to do light blue for theater, but... and then I highlight some things that are really important, like senior meetings and stuff. And then purple is like fun things. So I use my comically large highlighter to highlight like homework things, or like super important homework things, because yesterday like I had to finish my expose essay, and I had to submit my sociology homework, so that's how I stay organized this year. We have my sociology notebook. I was finishing my homework during Expos today because after our vocab quiz, we did nothing. So I did my sociology homework, so now I'm done with that. That was great. I finished like just in time. It was pretty, pretty lit. So we take a lot of notes. So I'm trying to take like, oh, someone's calling me. Hi guys. So I just got a phone call about an ESS interview. So yeah, that was exciting. We got some green. I usually use like a color theme for the day. This one was pink and purple. Um, what else we got? We got some blue going on in here. Um, so yeah, sociology is pretty fun. Today we had candy and played a game with a balloon to like learn about groups and stuff. This is my laptop! I got this this year. I'm really glad I did because high schools like they've gotten progressively more technology based and this year it was like shoo! Like they literally have us doing bathroom passes with technology <laughs> and it's 
really not great. It's not a great system. So I'm really glad I got this because all of my classes, like, it really comes in handy. The teachers will be like, do you guys have devices today? And we're like, yes. And then we're able to, like, take notes and stuff. I got to decorate it with stickers. I printed a lot of these out myself. The only real ones are the Wee Bear Bear stickers are real. Like, I bought those from somewhere. Then these ones, the Vine stickers are real. Lauren bought me that one. Rachel bought me those. And then this was from D23 Expo and this was from the Pride Festival. But the other ones I printed out. And they look really good. I'm going to show you up close because I'm really proud. This is like the most me thing I've ever seen. It's like the epitome of me. So we've got Gucci Gang, but written in supreme font. I made that. I did, ow. I did that. We got Spongebob and Patrick. I love this wee bear bear. And Nina pointed out that I made him point to the Gucci Gang. And that was slightly intentional. I'm not going to lie. Then we have a Winnie the Pooh to represent Disney. And then we got YouTube. Ross points out that it says tube. Um, we got the Care Bears. Minecraft pickaxe. This is my name in Lord of the Rings Elvish. We have some Ariana Grande references here, although I accidentally covered the Anur, so it just says sweet. But, and then they got like the NASA. And then we got Lord of the Rings. Love it. Avengers A, Iron Man, Groot, and the birds work for the bourgeoisie. This one's one of my favorites. Um, I just, I found a sticker picture online and then I printed it on my own sticker paper. So that's my laptop. It's an Asus and it's, you know, light and great. And then if you open it, there's actually more stickers. Haha, -ha, we have more wee bear bears. So we have ice bear with a stack of blocks that say ice bear, and then we have all of them when they're like babies, and it's really cute. And then my lock screen are the Avengers, but in chibi form. And then my home screen is like a picture. Then we have my film studies notebook. We are going to start watching Psycho on Monday. Right now, we've been spending time taking notes on the different aspects of film, so cinematography, mise-en-scene, editing, sound, that's it, um, so far in this class. So it's pretty, pretty nice, you know? Look at this, I've been trying to do that thing that people do, this one. And then last but not least, we have this green folder here that I keep Key Club Finance stuff in because it's green, and green looks like money. And that's actually it, it's pretty clean in there. And then usually I keep goldfish and apples in my backpack too because I get out of school pretty early because I have an off roll at the end of the day, so I just figure I can go home and eat lunch. Because I really, I'm a very busy person, so I don't really have time to eat while I'm at school. I'm usually doing things during lunch, so I just bring snacks. And all my teachers let me eat in their classes, so it's great. But I don't because I feel awkward when it's like silent. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video, and I will see you in my next one. Bye!